Okay, can you hear me now? Can you hear me okay? I'm getting confused. So you guys are saying you can hear me and then you guys say you can't hear me. So I'm not sure. Um, anyhow, hello, hello. Hi, Trina. Hi, Cheryl. How are you guys? Hi, Miss Edie. Hello, Miss Linda. No sound. Now you came through loud. No, you came through. I'm confused. I can hear you. Hi, Trees. Hi, Sharon. Hi, Diana. How's everybody doing? Good evening, Jan. Now I can sprinkle, did all things. Okay, thank you, Elizabeth. Oh, I don't know. Um, my voice is cutting in and out. Can you guys let me know what's happening? Some of you are saying you can't hear me. Some of you are saying you can hear me loud and clear. Some of you are saying that you I'm going in and out. I am so confused. Not in and out, just quiet. Oh my goodness gracious. Okay, I'm gonna just get going because I'm confused. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what's happening. I that's why I'm getting confused, Sue Russin, because it's either it's not one or the other. It's like I can hear you, I can't hear you at all, and then you're breaking up. <laughs> I'm just like ah. okay. So we are gonna start a new project today. Um I just got this at the Hobby Lobby, I believe. Ashlyn, is that Hobby Lobby or Michaels? I don't know. Anyways, it says it was $14.99. There's no way that I paid $14.99. Hi, Audrey. Okay, thank you. <laughs> it, it's, it's definitely a Monday. You guys know I have my hat on and everything. So, <laughs> um, yeah, new project. So, I thought what we would do, um, obviously, I do want to put some um, would you been trim around the edges. I'm thinking, because if you can see the wood, uh, I think I'm going to leave the legs alone, but, you know, we can see how that goes. Hi, Annette. Thank you. And then what I'd like to do is decoupage on top and then do do a resin pour, an epoxy resin pour with you guys. Hi, Dina. Oh, also, if you were on my auction on Friday, the mailman backed up to my door and took it all with a smile, nonetheless. So maybe he was in a good mood today. But everything is gone. Um, also... Thank you so very much for all of the birthday wishes for Toy Toy, all of the gifts. Um, yeah, he 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 was very happy. Um, a couple gifts came for him today, and he was all smiles. So I I thank you all very much. Um, I think that's just amazing. So I love you all for that, and just thank you. Hi, Miss Kathy. Hi, Rennie. Hi, Lori. Thank you, Margaret. Okay. So, I have a pool. He had an amazing birthday. I mean, we don't do anything all kind of crazy, but, you know, the gifts are all the things for Troy. And he just, every time he opened a present, he did his little one finger cock, you know, because his I love you was just the one finger. And every time I gave him a present, he was just like, it was awesome. So, um, I want to put a trim on the outside here. Anyhow, how are you feeling, uh, Trina, by the way? Are you good now? 
I pulled a couple of trims. You guys have to help me, as always. You guys know I always want your help. Um, I don't know. I do, I pulled, this is the Chris Hunter collaboration. This is an older one. I do like uh, the swirls on both of these. Or we could do, um, I feel like that one's a little thick. Or we can use this one that has like the, the holly, well, it's leaves. And it, I think it's actually called the Christmas trim. Oh, good. I'm glad you're good. So, I don't know. Do you guys have a preference? Let me bring you down a little bit and see what you guys think. <clears throat> All right. So, or do you need me to lay it flat on here to be able to tell? The sound is low again. Huh? I I I don't know, you guys. I'm not. I I don't change anything, so I'm not sure what's happening with my if why my sound is low. It, I, I'm not sure. I mean, nothing short from me screaming. I don't know what else to do. I talk loud as it is, so I'm not sure what's happening um now i'm now i'm confused what's happening trace you think this one the thinner one i i really like this one because you see the beading on the sides too so i think that one would be super pretty Okay, so it hasn't changed. It's good. You can hear me fine. Okay, thank goodness. The narrow one with the beading, this one. Okay, so this one is the um, 706. So it's the W U B T R. so would you been trim TR 706. Let me bring you out. Um, so I'm going to start heating this up, and then... I'm going to put it around one. <laughs> I'm telling you what. I'm going to grab my um, pipe bond because okay. So yesterday was our little Zoom meet and greet. Hey, Angel. Um, very generous. I, I, what did I miss? Thank you, Sharon. What did I miss? Uh, hi, Ari. How's mama? So yesterday was our Zoom meet and greet, and I got to see some of you again and meet some, a few more of you, and oh my goodness, you guys, it's just so awesome. I loved it. Um, if you are in the group, you're going to see that I put up a poll um, just to see what you guys thought about when the next class should be, if it should be on like a Friday, Saturday, or Sunday, and then I put the times in there that it could happen, so if you get a chance to go over to the Crafting Chaotix group, please do and um, check the poll out and see what, you know, give your input on what you think would work. Because um, I definitely want to schedule another one for December. Um, but, you know, I thought maybe I'd, I'd see if Sundays are good or if we should change them. So. If you get a moment, just go in and check the poll out. I always tell you guys, but when you have a coil, make sure you store your coil back um, like this. Okay, don't don't let it lay flat because it is it will break. Um, yeah, and some of you missed it, and um, 
that's fine. You're not always going to be able to make all of them, but hopefully, you know, you'll make a couple and we will eventually get to meet everyone. Um, so, hi, Beth. Hi, Carol. Oh, good, Ari. Hi, Donna Sue. How are you? Right, so I'm just going to, it's a longer piece. So I'm gonna try to heat it up as I, much as I can, get the glue on, and then as we're rounding mm -hmm. it, we'll probably need to keep heating it up because it's, I have the fan on me as usual. I just got done working on the project I am trying to get done with some people. Oh, I can't wait, Angel. Ooh, I can't wait to see it. Okay. So you can use your fingers or you can use, you know, a brush. You guys, I tell you all the time, I'm messy enough as it is. So I just tend to try to be as tidy as possible. So I'm only going to put glue on a little bit at a time because I know it's going to cool off before I can get it all the way on. Um, I'll put the, I think I'll put these in here. See, it's already cooling down. And make sure you don't force your wood to bend. If you got to heat it up to get it to bend, heat it back up. Don't try to force it down. But yeah, it was fun. Um. I had to host Teresa Renee yesterday on DQ for um, about an hour, so I was on mute a little bit of the time, um, but I was, you know, I could still hear hear the ladies talking in my ear, and I was, you know, piping in whenever I could, but we stayed in there for, you know, it was almost... So we got on at one and we got off just a little before five. So we were in there almost the full four hours. Um, you know, most of us had to get dinner going or eat dinner or something. So, but it was, it was nice. Um, you know, we had Jill was in there from the UK and Andrew. So they were able to join us for a little while. Of course, it got later. So, you know, understandably, they had to hop off after a couple hours. But, and um, we found out some of the ladies are quite near each other. So we, you know, so a lot of us were crafting um, and chatting so it was exactly what i had hoped it would be you know just being able to meet up with some friends and just chit chat and craft if you wanted to ask questions um so yeah it was it was great fun so we'll definitely be planning another one um but I know, you know, with Christmas and Christmas shopping and all of that, that, you know, folks are going to be busy. So we'll try to find a time and a day that hopefully will work so that, you know, folks can get in there and join us. Hi, Helen. Hi, Miriam. Oh, Miss Linda. That's absolutely more important, seeing those grandbabies. I completely understand. And again, there'll be more. So hopefully, you know, even Sue popped in there for a minute, which I was pleasantly surprised. I thought that was pretty amazing. I did not expect her to come in there, so I thought that was pretty cool. A lot of good advice. Yeah, and that a lot of good advice. 
there was some questions and when you get, you know, a few people together, you're bound to, have, somebody's bound to know an answer, right? So that's what's really cool too. So, all right, so I'm just going to get this little bit. Um, and then I'll, I always cut it a little longer than needed because, you know, you can always cut it. You can't add it. Well, I guess you could, but it just makes it a little bit more difficult. Okay, so you'll see where I started out. It started to slip a little bit. So we'll heat that back up and put it back where I want it to be. Hi, Helena. We even met Helena and Kaylee. It was so freaking cute, you guys. Oh, my goodness. And Troy Troy kept popping his head in because, you know, he knew people were. I was talking to somebody and heard voices, so he kept popping his little head in every now and again. All right. So now... I'm going to actually, let me see. I'm going to cut it first and then I might sand it to see. Actually, I'm going to put it in my lap for just a second so I can take about an eighth more off and then get it down. All right. Okay. So Kaylee wants to see Troy Troy again soon. She kept saying how cool it was. Oh, I love it. Yeah. And I didn't even put it together when you came in and it said her name. I was like, Oh, Kaylee. Okay. We have a new person, Kaylee. And then you said Helena, and I went, oh, so that was super cute. All right, so I did heat that up a little bit, and I'm moving it up. Now, same thing. I'm going to just kind of go around and make sure it didn't slip anywhere, get the glue off of my finger. Now what I want to do is just heat it up and make sure that the glue is adhering everywhere. Like here, I'm going to need to push it down. Um, I believe it was either Hobby Lobby or uh, Michael's. I'll get the link and put it in there. It's Ashland, Ashland Fall. It's Ashland. So I'm thinking maybe Michael's. Because usually the wood will stay like um, the wood pile if it's Hobby Lobby. So I'm pr probably thinking Michael's. All right. And then right here, I want to make sure it's pushed in. I don't know, Beth. Rennie is saying the same thing. Rennie is saying she can hardly hear me. I don't know what it is. Others are saying that they can hear me just fine. I don't, I don't know. I'm not sure what's happening. I mean, I've been, we're at 101 episodes now, and I haven't changed anything. So... I'm not sure what's happening, if it's a me thing or if it's a, well, Sue said that it was having problems and she's on YouTube, so I don't know, because I haven't changed anything. Um, I have everything. I have Samsung. I have a laptop. I have a external camera. See, Sharon says she can hear me perfectly. Lori says she has her volume all the way up. Can't hear. It's a Facebook thing, so I don't know. I'm not sure. 
The only thing I can do is take you off so you guys won't be able to see me and completely go to just my hands. If you guys want me to do that, I can do, I can, I can change it. So if you guys don't need to see me, which is fine, you don't really need to see me, I can take my face off and you guys will just go to hands and it'll go over to my computer system. So just let me know, I can take it off. All right, so here's what the trim looks like. So cute. Keep my face, please. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what else to do, you guys. I mean, aside from not doing any lives for a while until I figure it out. I mean, um, cause I, if it's, if it's Facebook, I mean, if it's irritating, you know, I don't want you guys to have to watch if it's irritating. So I can, um, I don't know. Maybe I won't do uh, a live uh, and then try to figure it out and do some tests. Okay, so I'm going to just take the Waverly plaster um, and do this all white. Again, like I said, I'm not going to do the legs for right now. Um, okay, do you guys see how there's like a little gap right here? I'm just being picky, but I'm going to heat this up and make sure that it's stuck. All lives have options for captions. All you need to do is tap your screen and put captions on. All lives. You can always do um, closed caption on lives. Okay. So I just heated that back up because I seen there was a little bit of a gap and I'm just being picky. It's underneath. It's not like anybody would see it, but I know that it's there. So the whole sound thing is throwing me off, guys. Sorry. <laughs> okay, so let me get, um, I don't know what to do about that. Hi, Jamie. Hi, Karen. Yeah, I just, I don't know. Dana, I, I understand it's probably frustrating, so I don't know what to do other than just not do lives until I figure it out. So um, I'll try to look and see what's happening. And um, when I figure it out, then I'll, I'll schedule. I'll schedule it back on. Because those of you who were on Zoom yesterday, could you hear me? Nobody complained about it when we were in Zoom yesterday. And I'm on the same system on Zoom. Could you guys hear me in Zoom yesterday? I would be really interested to know that because that it's the same same setup for Zoom. Sound was just fine. Yes, we heard you fine. So I don't know, because if it's my system, then I would think my sound would be off everywhere, not just, you know, in one place or two, because Sue's on YouTube. So I don't know. I don't know. No good, though. No good. I kind of want to put something on here. I forgot all about that. Doggone it. Um, I kind of wanted to put something up here. Ugh. I guess not now. I can't do that, Sue. I don't have control over that. All 
I don't choose the volume on the intro. I don't think it's you, Terry. I signed out, came back in, and had sound. Yeah, I don't know, y'all. Yeah, I don't choose the volume on the intro. I mean, that's all that's all on your on the receiving end on how loud or how low you have the volume. I don't know why I'm struggling using that brush. Use a soft brush. It did take me seven years to paint the doggone trim. <laughs> I really like the, the beading on here. It's super pretty. God, I hope Sunny didn't share this live into the group. Hi, Callie. Sunny from Would You Been was going to share this live into the Would You Been group. I hope not. <laughs> With all these sound issues, I really hope not. That's going to be awful. Sorry. Okay. So now we get to pick the paper. Well, that was dumb. Woo wee. Well, I guess we'll end up having to paint that now. <laughs> yeah, I hope <laughs> trees. <laughs> Oh, hi, Angela. So what I wanted to do prior to me not using my head is I wanted to put like something here. Obviously, it wouldn't be the whole thing. I was thinking of like just that middle and put it on here. But I don't know. I got distracted. My brain is not working today. Okay, so now we have to pick the paper. And of course, you know, it can't be easy. I didn't just pull out one paper. So I was thinking we could do one of the pretty. So this one is Dainty and the Queen Jolly. Now, these are a little big, but the A4 is a little small. So I'm thinking if we do these, I'd want to go with the A3. Or, or we could do the plaid. So we could do any one of these because these would fit on here. And what didn't fit, we would just, you know, color match it. What else did I pull out? Or, sorry, I took out a piece, but winter scenes would look super pretty on here too. So I don't know if we want to do something like that. And of course, I took out a piece of this too, but then we also have um, the clocks. So I don't know. And then if we didn't like any of those, I mean, you know, by golly, I could use any of the A4s would work perfectly on there. So 
Let me grab though. I do want to grab. Whoa. I do want to grab Jolly out and see um, the difference on the paper. Jolly or the winter scene, right? See, but then also look. He would look great on there too. Well, before I get out a new paper, see, these are just too small. I don't want to use Jolly in the A4 because I want it to be the entire top. Um, and then same thing with these. They're too small. So that's why I grabbed. But if we, the other one that I thought would look cute on here is in the back. It's in the back. Why do you keep looking in the front? My gardeners came at seven o'clock this morning again, you guys. So I don't know. I guess he's back to uh, doing seven o'clock in the morning. So these would also look cute on there too, because we can pick any section of those. I like the parasol papers. See, I know. Those are the ones that I liked, too. Um, so we could pick any part of, you know. So this one is the spirit of Christmas. And then this one is postcard collage. You see, he would, look, he would look good on there. But let's put Jolly back up there and see. I know. So do we like the deer or do we like the traditional carousel horse? Hi, Marianne. The sides have the wood you've been trimmed. Callie, that we just put on. Um, depending on how far I put it, yeah, not, we wouldn't lose, well, we would lose this foot here. On him, we wouldn't. On the, on the deer, we wouldn't. We might lose a little bit, but for the most part, we would get him on there. Hi, Kathy. Thank you. The winter scene. This one. Or this one's at the top. I mean, there's a bunch of them on here that let, look pretty. So it looks like you guys like either one of these two. I can pull out a new, a new winter scene if we if we want. So yeah, on the on the horse or the deer, we're gonna lose a little bit of their of their feeties. A little. This one will lose probably both of its feeties. Oh well, no, just one. It looks like, and then this one is going to lose just this little bit. So some of you are saying the winter scene and some of you are saying <sighs> in an equal amount. All right, so let's... <laughs> it is. I'm going to pull out a new winter scene so we can see. What if you raise the horse and lose the point? Um, so here's the top of the board. Yeah. 
Yeah, we can. The way that it is, we would still lose just a little bit of this, this here. Just a little bit. And we would actually still get a lot of the poinsettia. poinsettia. Right. No, I wouldn't. I would have to adjust and do color matching with the winter scenes just because they're so close together that I wouldn't be able to. Um, the heck? I wouldn't be able to just take it free and clear. However, I will say that she has another paper. Dainty and the Queen has another paper that we can make up. Remember, she did this one. So the Christmas florals works with the um, Christmas scenes. So I could, you know, I could do something with the A4 paper. Hmm. So that being said, if we were to do this here, and then I take the A4, all right, yep, we got it. Okay, so we're gonna do we're gonna do the winter scene. I'm gonna grab the A4 of this and use some of the flowers from this one in the A4 size. Too many papers. All right. Whoa. There we go. We get there in the end. Yes, it is, right? This one? I think so, too. Okay, so we are going to have to see they're so close together that I'm just going to have to take what I can. Um, and then we will fill in what we need to with the other piece. So I'm just going to take my water pen and I'm going to take as much as I can and then we'll deal with the white afterwards. Okay, Miriam. Ah, uh, nose is running again because of the fan, but still hot. One day I got to wear um, long sleeves. One day. Oh no, my brush in water. Ow, I'm out of it today. One day. Okay, so let's get. See, so we'll put that towards the bottom, and then we'll put one of these pretty ones up at the top. I think that will be better balance in the carousel. Hi, Tina. How are you? Yeah, unfortunately, the A3 is... Um, big, right? A lot bigger. And the A4 is just too small. I mean, it's not. It would just literally sit kind of like in the middle, like a circle straight in the middle. So, right. we will still end up having to 
do a little bit of color matching, but not very much. And then let's take, see, we can take any one of these. Um, I think these are the same, they're just reversed. Okay, so let's just take one down here. And then I'm going to use, use my water pen to come, and then I'll adjust what I need when I put it on the board. So what else did you guys do this weekend? Did you guys do anything? Anybody start Christmas shopping this weekend? Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah. I don't want to. I'm Chris on Christmas shopping strike. I did put Trevor on notice and I put Nick on notice. I was like, okay, hey, what's the date today? I need Christmas lists. <laughs> Actually, Trevor's birthday is on December 1st. So I told him I need a Christmas and birthday list from you, sir. Okay, so we're going to get this one on here. I'm not worried about the edges just yet. We'll either get a blade or I will get a high grit and sand. The reason why um, I have to be careful, right, because it is wood you've been on the side. So it's wood particles. If I get a low grit and sand, it's going to sand down the trim. Okay, and then we're going to put this here. So I'm trying to see what I want uh, of it. Uh, oh, yeah, Trotoy? What are you watching? Huh? What are you watching? Do you agree? Hi, Lori. Kaylee is having a horror-filled horror Christmas. <laughs> oh, Beth. I forgot. Oh, my goodness. Goodness gracious, Beth. Is it, is it letting up at all? Do you, is it, oh goodness, if you're sitting in chamomile all week, and I'm assuming not. Okay, so when you fray your edges, you know the blend is better. So I'm actually going to go ahead and put this one down. I'm going to sand back that, and then I'll add this one to it. So let me get my decoupage, decoupage varnish and glue. The matte, hi, Miss Wanda. And then I'm just going to get a make sure it gets down in the there's a couple of grooves down here from the wood, so I just want to make sure it gets down in there. And then... Make sure that it's not crooked, y'all. I'm famous for crooked. Oh, that's going to be so pretty. All right rest of that on. Hi, Miss Linda. How are you? Thank you, Miss Wanda. All right. And then Oh, Lord. 
Amazon is here. I don't think I ordered anything. They shouldn't be coming here. <laughs> George, George just went. <laughs> you seen the Amazon guy come? <laughs> it just <laughs> he like dropped his phone on the couch and stood up. Oh Lordy B, Troy Troy, you are something else. All right, let's get this down. And I'm going to get these fibers down. And then we're going to actually dry this a little bit because I want to do some sanding here so I can blend the other piece with this. <laughs> That's what I do. Watch for the milk. Oh, how fun, Tina. That's one thing I have not done is made um, Christmas cards. Even when I was doing like, you know, birthday cards or whatever, I, I did not sit and ever do like Christmas cards. I don't know why. I think it would be fun. I think it would take me a while, that's why, because I would want everyone to have a different one. So cutting all the dies and, you know, doing the stamping and everything else, it would probably take me, I probably would go past Christmas before people would get their doggone cards. <laughs> oh, yeah, Tina from Furniture, take a little... Amazon didn't come here. I don't think so. Torch is sitting at the window like, what the hell? You didn't drop me anything. You already opened some gifts today, Torch. You already opened your mail today. Your Miriam and Jamie. Okay, so I'm just drawing, especially up there at the top where I want to do some sanding. I'm getting a high grit. Um, I'm going to take a 600. And then I'm going to sand this back a little bit. You already opened your mail today, son. And you got one Christmas. Usually make about 70 different Christmas cards. I have slacked off. Oh, my goodness. 70? Holy guacamole! Terry, have you painted on a live? Okay, Trace, I never know if you're messing with me or if you're being serious. What do you mean, have I painted on a live? Painted what? I'm not falling for it. I'm not falling for it, uh, Trace. What are you what are you talking about? Ah, oh, Dana. <laughs> Thank you. I'm waiting for Trees to tell me because I want to know if she's messing with me. Thank you so much for the stars, Dana. You don't have to do that. I really appreciate it. Okay, so I'm just gonna take, like I said, a six hundred. And I'm going to come up here where I want to join that other piece and just sand this back a little bit. I've done so many Christmas cards in my lifetime just for my job, about a thousand per year. I work with the postmaster. You are a painter and I have not seen you paint. Oh! <laughs> you mean a um, watercolor? I have not done a live um, doing any watercoloring. No, I have not. Mm -mm. Oh, 
was like, I pinked all the time. What do you mean? I thought you were setting me up, Trace. It's so cool. Look at how it's like making it look like it's, you know, perforated because of the the wood, the trim. <laughs> what, Papas? Where are your earbuds? Oh, you got you. They're in your ear, you silly goose. There's a really long fiber right here, so instead of continuously trying to sand it, I am just going to cut it, and there's one right there, too. Perfect. Mm. 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 Please do, Terry. Mm. I'd love to watch you paint. Mm. Really? Mm. I didn't think anybody would, um, oh, I don't know where the other one is, Troy. It's not in my pockets, I promise. I didn't think anybody uh, was interested in watercolor, to be honest. Okay, so I don't want to cover up this, so I'm going to take that little like greenery off. And then I'm going to come in and get as close as I can. So I want to keep that flower, and I think I like that. Maybe take a little bit off here. Really? I'll have to, I'll have to do something. I don't know, I just never, I don't see anybody really doing live watercoloring. I didn't think. Okay, so I'm going to do that like that. Yeah? Let's put some more medium down. What are you doing? And I'm going to push the fibers this way because I want it to lay flat. I don't want the fibers to buckle. Art is art. I love watercolor. It's your favorite. Really? See, it. a lot of people um, I found, well, I know this was a while ago, too, is that, you know, watercolor, they think that, you know, it's not opaque. And, you know, they think of, like, the watercolor, what, you know, back in the day with the, the, the little pods and stuff. And it, it's, it's not like that at all you can make it as opaque as you want it to be but you know it does take patience to to work with watercolors how oh, interesting i'll have to do something so look at that see how pretty that is so again, I'm pushing the fibers down this way, and then we'll get this dried. And we'll do a little bit. We don't even have to, actually. We could just add another piece there if we wanted to. That sprig that I took off, we could just add there. Yeah, we'll do some painting there. I need to get that rice paper to realize how pretty it is. Yeah, it's beautiful. Let's 
Stephanie from Vintage Pebbles. Oh, really? I don't know who that is. I have to check that out. You don't know where it is? I'm not sure, son. Maybe in the couch? You better get your money, Papas. Get your money. Put it in your wallet. Onyx is going to eat it. Lions, tigers, and bears. Oh, my. <laughs> All right, so let's take off. I did a lot of um, stuff for like kids' rooms, watercoloring, a lot of pandas and, you know, the cute bears and the cute, I did a lot of that. See, now look, <clears throat> where did that piece go? See, what if I cut, like I was saying, let's take this off. Hey, hey, Shelly Stacklin. What the heck? I know I just cut this, what happened? So, we obviously, what do you guys think if I just took the middle of that and put that on there? Can you see what I'm saying? So, cut off this, the, the edges. I came in and saw poo, huh? Huh? Hi, Drusilla. How are you? What do you mean, poo? <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> I can't with you, Shelly. What the hell? See, so we'll cut. Oh, uh, guys. We'll cut off this little bit, and we'll cut off. Hold up. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Wait, 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 wait. Do we like this? Why does it look like turn the other way? What does it look like turn the other way? This? Hi, Cindy. Oh, I missed it. <laughs> I missed Tracy's comment. Seen you say when they came in and see seen poo. I thought you were talking about my project. I'm like, what? I like it the other way too. So this way or this way? I like it this. You like you like I like it sideways. But which was sideways? Oh, I like it turned this way. You guys like it better this way? Okay, so if it's this way, then am I going to move it up this way and then cut off? You see what I'm saying? Move it up like that and then cut off the excess? <laughs> no, don't cut it. Really? Don't cut it? Don't cut at all. Do you have to cut it? I like it the first way. I don't have to cut it. So you guys want me to leave it like that and don't cut it. Okay, look. Hold on. This is what was happening with the sound. Do we like it 
this is number one because there's a lag. So when I move things, I'm moving it after I read. So number one or number two. But whatever way we're saying not to cut it, right? I'm just going to cut it because I thought that maybe it, it was going to look funny, but I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. One, one. Oh, sugar. One, one, two. One, 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 one. One, one, two, two. Okay, so one. Okay, so this way, right? Number one wins, but don't cut it. Really, guys? Are you guys fibbing? Are you guys joshing me? Don't cut it and leave it like that. Either way, it'll have to be cut. I'm leaving. I'm out of here. <laughs> I love you too, Bubs. Are you trying to help me? No, you can't have my phone. I think it needs to be cut too. One and cut. No cut, number one. No cut. Don't cut. Leave it. Okay, but look, think of this this way, okay? If we have it this way, and it's not cut, because remember, I'm going to put epoxy resin on here. If somebody wants to put something on here food-wise, they could. If we leave it like this, isn't that weird to pick up? Because naturally, the way that it's shaped, someone's going to want to pick it up like this, right? So we're going to pick it up, and it's not going to be cut? If you guys hate it, there's another one. <laughs> Killing me, Smalls. Killing me, Smalls. Know what I mean, Jelly Bean? It just will. It will. It 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 it'll, it'll look real, really kind of funny if we don't cut it. We don't cut it. We need to cut it. Well, now when you explain it, cut it. <laughs> Pick it up from the bottom. <laughs> oh my God, you guys are so great. Okay, so let's heat this up. We'll have to cut it, and then we'll have to sand it. To make it look like it was supposed to be that way. <laughs> All right, what's on here? Okay, we'll use that one. Ah, <laughs> uh, thank you. One and cut. Okay, Mishana. <laughs> one and done. All right, so let's make sure this one is soft so that way. When I put it on, it's not going to. Hmm. Yeah, it is, Miriam. You could glue it back together. But I have another one. At the end of the day, we have another one. <laughs> okay. So I am going to leave that little part sticking up off of there. Yeah. And then I'm going to glue everything else down and I put my brush in water as usual. I end up washing so many brushes. That's all right. All right. So now let's get that where we want it to be. And 
And see, I like the way it curves naturally up here with that handle. Okay, Dana, have a good rest of your day. Aw, Ari. <laughs> All right. Okay, and then I'm gonna not put that in glue, not in water just yet. Stay, please. Okay, don't. And then let's heat it up to make sure it's on there good. I'm going to take my and then we'll cut. And I'm actually going to turn it this way and get my and then I'll sand back whatever whoops whatever um, edges so that way it'll be nice and smooth. So we'll sand that and then let's get this one. Same thing. I just want to cut off. I think I'm going to cut off a little bit more on this side because it's not going to just yet. Sand down back a little bit and see. Even amount? I think so. Okay. This side. I can hear you, Troy, but I can't see you, son. You got to come over here. Okay, so this is coming in a little bit, but this side isn't because I didn't cut it that way. So I just need to heat it up and cut that groove in that side. This one is, I think this one is a 240, Rennie. Let me make sure. Uh, 180. All right. So now, I'm gonna cut that groove in on this side. And 
and let's round it out. Trying to make them even, y'all. Okay. Looks like it's over. Let me put her on top. Down. What? What's happening? What's happening now? Something happened with the sound again? How can something happen with the sound again when I didn't even do anything? All right. Hi, Betty. Hi, Carol. What do you guys think? So now we got to paint that. <clears throat> oh, no. Kind of did. Okay, so now we need to... Okay. So Sue, I never got louder for you. It still stayed um still stayed low. I don't know. But see, and then when I watch it back on replay, it sounds fine. So I'm I don't know how I'm gonna be able to tell to fix this problem. Well, when I turn away, yeah, that would make sense because, I mean, the mic is over here, and if I'm facing that way, I'm not facing the mic, but I don't think that's what they're saying, Betty. They've been saying that they can't hear me since I started. Actually, they've been saying they can't hear me since for some reason, last week, last Friday or something. But then they said they heard me just fine when I was on with Teresa yesterday. So I, I don't know. It's confusing. A fly is attacking me. <laughs> Dirty. That's another onyx girl. All right, so I'm just going to take out a few colors. I need to paint this, and I don't know what we're going to do to that, but we'll see. Your audio is a little lower than usual for me, but I just turned up my volume. Yeah. Yeah. I don't, I don't know. All right, so I'm just mixing some of the country blue, the ice blue, and a little bit of ivory. You guys know I need to I need to color match over here. <clears throat> Let's 
So I'm just taking probably need to pull in a green. Hold on. Need to pull in a little bit of green because it's not totally blue. <clears throat> You do sound not as loud as usual for me, but I can hear you and I have my volume. Yeah, see, I don't, I'm not quite sure what's happening. Um, I don't know, you guys. Like I said, the only thing I can. I could do this. Watch. Can you guys hear me? I can't do it that way. Because there's going to be feedback. Nope. Yeah. I don't know, you guys. Sorry. I'll be off of here in just a few minutes. I will leave you guys in just a few minutes. And All right, so there was no paper here at the edge, so I just did a little bit of color matching there. I don't know if you guys can even tell. So there was no paper all right here. Um, there's nothing down here either, but it's very, very light. Got a little bit more blue in there. Yeah, you guys can hear me, but there was a huge echo because there's feedback. So... The only thing I could do about that is just take my face completely off. So, um, and just use the two cameras instead of the three. So, um, I'll show you guys what I mean. So, I'm just blending where there's no paper. Just correcting where there's no paper first, and then we'll figure out what um, color that we need to paint everything. I don't know when. Hey, you like seeing me? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Super frustrating to watch somebody if you can't hear them. So I'm not sure what I what to do. So 
hopefully I can figure it out. All right, so it looks like there is, I don't know why I just used that brush. That was the wrong brush. That was my blending brush. <laughs> Okay, so now there's paper, well, not paper, but now there's color on all of the edges. That looks really different on screen than it does here. It's not that blue. What the heck? Maybe I just need a vacation from wives. Today is just all wrong. Come on, baby boy. Yeah, mom's done. I'm, I'm done. Mm. Oh, there you go. I don't know what happened there. It mm. it matches here, mm. but on screen it looks really mm. strange. But anyhow, um. Okay, so let me. Oh, it's okay over here. Okay, well that's fine. All right. So now uh, it's time for me to leave you guys, which you guys are probably like, thank God. <laughs> So um, I will need to figure out what color to actually paint the rest of this. God bless you, son. Um, I don't know what I'm going to do, y'all. Um, I don't know. I will. I don't. I will maybe see about doing um, a test live um, and. It just the thing it is the thing that is weird is when I go back to listen to the replay to see how low it is, it's fine. It's not low. So I don't know how to fix something when I don't know what's wrong. Does that make sense? Because when I go for the replay and I'm like, okay, I shouldn't be able to hear the replay it's fine. So I, I'm not sure. And I don't know. So, um, we'll see if you guys, if I can get a fix, you guys will see me on Wednesday. If not, then, um, hopefully on Friday. So anyhow, I hope you guys have a great rest of your day, your week, and I will see you. I don't know. I'll see you in a few days, maybe. Anyhow, I'll talk to you guys later. Have a great rest of your day. Thank you for being here. Bye.